talk about the president, Mr. President. We're gonna hop into the news. Joe Biden, Biden man. Big Biden. So uh so news broke out today. The White House released an official press statement saying that uh Joe Biden has received COVID-19. He was pre-tested positive. So I guess I don't know what that I'm pretty sure he's gonna quarantine, I guess they said. Um, but yeah, so you know. He, you know, he is elder. He's a little bit older. I don't remember if this is the first time or the second time or what if he if he caught it before. But, you know, it is definitely kind of scary when someone older catches it. For sure. But, um, yeah, man. But I wanted to say, like, what was what's your opinion on that? You know, because right now we're, we're, he's, you know, the, it's been a minute that we've had him. He's had a go at it. And a lot of people, including the liberals and Democrats, are not exactly saying that he's doing a great job, man. You know what I'm saying? And um, some people are even, you know, really upset and saying that they wouldn't vote for him again or vote for a liberal again or a democrat again i'm sorry and um so you know but yeah it's torn so what would you think you think that Bi- that biden's he's just doing the best that he could do with what he got or you think he, he could be stepping it up a little honestly bit? i think he's really like out there trying his best the thing is that first of all like i'll be seeing like mad like memes and stuff like that on his yeah. like, demeanor and i seen one where he uh what was it he was reading the prompt <laughs> And uh, he's reading the prop, and and he repeats like I think it says read next line. And he's like and read next line, and you know what I'm saying. He's like reading everything word for word on the prop. I remember you're an old dude, bro. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's old. You know what I mean? Like what what more can you expect? Although I mean we should expect some some somebody real witty <laughs> and, and, and yeah, and, you someone. know what I'm saying as as president. I mean what Bar- Barack Obama when he became president, I think he was like in his forties, right? Yeah, he was like, yeah, 40s to just turn early 40s, I think. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, so, in my opinion, I think there should be an age cap on presidency. You know what I'm saying? There's, there's right. age caps on a, a, lot, a lot of other things. Presidency, I think that's yeah. the one. But as for yeah, it is, yeah. how everything is like going in the country, unfortunately, shit, shit, shit ain't that great right now. And it's under, yeah, pres- it's not- it's under Biden's pres- presidency. So, once again, unfortunately, everything's going to fall on him. That's just how it, that's just how it works. So... Shit, my man's ain't doing that much of a great job, as you can see. You know what I mean? He, yeah, he's not. Um, he's not doing great. And uh, um, a lot of people are saying, you know, I think it should be just as you know, Trump had his his negatives and his mess ups and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. It should be acknowledged that Biden is has is also not having a great go at it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, um, and on top of that too is like, uh, well, you know, a, you know, a lot of things have changed, and because I've told people like. Biden, you know, we were coming off of two presidents. First was Obama, then it was Trump. Say how you feel about either one, but they were both very enthusiastic. Yeah. <laughs> they were both very um, to the point. They were both very, you know, uh, alert of certain things. Yeah, yeah. Biden just, he just doesn't give any of that to me, man. You know, he's just like, he, he's just kind of there. And then when he even, you know, a lot of people are also up in arms about the fact that he is saying that as long as Ukraine is going to suffer, that we're going to suffer when it comes to gas prices oh, and stuff nah. like that. And <laughs> yeah, he said man. that, man. That he got on TV and said that. He said as long as Ukraine's yeah. suffering, Americans are going to have to deal with these high gas prices because he's going to keep sending the money. So I don't know, man. I just feel like he hasn't shown uh, his whole Tim and his team. I'm not going to say it's just him, but him and his team have not shown that they deserve to be in this position that they're in. In my opinion, that's just my opinion. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, I, mean? I feel you. I feel you. And um, yeah, that's that's one thing where I love. I'm, I'm glad you said him and his team. You know what I'm saying? Because people gotta yeah. remember, bro. He's a human being as well. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that man's somebody's father. This, that, and the other. You know what I'm saying? He's a human being. So I don't think he's out there trying to be the devil and destroy America. Um, himself. Yeah. It's it, it's it's him and his team. You know what I'm saying? Not destroying America, but like just not doing that great of a job. So right. that's how I feel about that. Right, bro. For real, for real, same. Um, so yeah, we're gonna keep y'all up to date on that. We're gonna see what else happens. We're gonna see when, and hopefully, you know, Biden pulls through with COVID, and you know, um, oh, we'll fact. see. Yeah, the COVID, the COVID is crazy. Bro. Like you said, he's he's up there in age, so that that's he black guy. Yeah. Yeah. So, so a little concerning. Up for that, man.